Hey Scorpio, welcome to my channel, Blessings of Love. My name is BB, and this is your weekly message for November 30th through December 6th, 2020. And this is for all of Scorpio Sun, Moon, and Rising Suns. And thank you guys so much for watching. I truly appreciate it. Okay, so Scorpio, for this week, you have Reconciliation, Honeymoon, Let Go of Control Issues, Four of Fire, Knight of Water, Nine of Fire, Nine of Water, Renewal, Ace of Water, King of Air, Six of Air, Six of Fire, Do Not Give Up, Rest Your Mind, Your Soulmate Awaits, and Empathy. Okay, so Scorpio, I definitely feel like if some of you are hoping and praying or some of you really want your partner to come back into your life, I definitely feel like someone from the past is coming back into your life and they want to reconcile and make it work. I definitely feel like somebody's going to come in and offer you offer you their cup of love. Um, I definitely feel like somebody really wants to push things forward for you. And if this is somebody that you've been going back and forth with for years or just for a long time, I feel like they're really going to try to make it work this time. So I definitely feel like an ex is coming back in and they want stability with you. Now, if you're dealing with someone new or if you've been dating someone for a while, um, I definitely feel like the relationship may be kicked up a notch. Um, I definitely feel like the relationship may, I feel like this person may offer you, um, they may ask you for your hand in marriage and they may want to marry you. I feel like this person also I'm here may want to move in with you or move in together. Um, I feel like some of you guys may, if you're not in a relationship, you just may, may be moving to a new home or traveling. Um, also, I feel like somebody may at you out on a date or somebody may at you to go out on a trip with them. But I definitely feel like whatever it is, I feel like you're going to be very excited. Um, I feel like some of you Scorpios, you have to let down your wall just a little bit. Allow love to flow. Allow love to come into you. So if you've been hoping for love, if you've been one in your ex back or someone from the past back, you have to let down your wall just a little bit and allow yourself to receive love. I feel like there is definitely, with the Ace of Water renewal and reconciliation, there's definitely going to be a renewal. There's definitely going to be a conversation about how can we make this relationship work. Um, I feel like if you separated from someone temporarily, I do feel like you and this person are coming back together. And when you do come back together, try not to control the situation. Again, just allow it to flow naturally. Take your time to really just reevaluate the relationship and see, is it really worth giving it another chance? Is this what I really want? So just take time to go with the flow and really just get to know this person all over again if you need to. Um, but don't allow your emotions to overwhelm you. Now, I definitely feel like also some of you may be dealing with a air sign, a Aquarius, Libra, a Gemini, or either a water sign, a Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. So I definitely feel like there may be somebody new or somebody old. Um, you're going to have choices when it comes to love this week. So take your time to really evaluate what direction do you want to go in as far as love? Because I feel like somebody is trying to offer you the moon and stars. And I feel like somebody is offering you excitement and fun. And you have to really decide, like, what do I really want right now? What is good for me? If some of you have been worrying about your relationship, I feel like this person is your soulmate. I feel like you should not give up on this connection. Um, I feel like have courage and have patience. I definitely feel like this is not the time to just give up or give in. Well, I shouldn't say give up, but hey, <laughs> but don't give up fully on this person. I definitely feel like there's still a chance to make your work. Uh, when I say give in, you can give in a little bit emotionally, but just make sure you're being open to the right person. Now, if this person treated you like trash in the past, then, you know, keep the wall up keep them in the past, but if this person really try is trying to make it work with you, and you guys just maybe had some minor disagreements, then, you know, it's okay to kind of just talk things through and see where it goes, because um, I definitely feel like some of you are going to fall in love with someone all over again. I definitely feel like this person is I feel like somebody is really going to open their heart to you, and it's really going to surprise you. 
So overall, I definitely feel like there's going to be a renewal of love. I feel like some of you may be taking your relationship to a higher level of commitment. They could be engagement. It could be married. Um, and also, I feel like somebody may invite you out on a date or on a trip. But I definitely feel like it is definitely going to be... I feel like this person is the love of your life or like you're a dream partner in a way. So, And I feel like this person is going to bring a lot of balance, a lot of stability into your life. I feel like this person is going to want to see you do your best and help you. I just feel like this person is very motivational in some way and they're going to help you push forward. If you're having a difficult time, I feel like they're going to be by your side. Um, I feel like this is definitely a partner that you're going to want to be with for the long term. So. Um, definitely overall, I feel like this is a very good reading for you, Scorpio, so don't give up on love, try to have patience, don't worry, I definitely feel like just allow it to flow, um, because if you go up the flow, I feel like you will be pleasantly surprised.